man, is that a two-stage rocket? Oh, three. I designed the engine myself. <laughs> cool. Can it break Mach 1? Probably, if I could get my hands on that new fuel the government's been working on. Oh, well, this just might be your lucky day. Howard, what happened to the Oreos I left on the counter? <laughs> I haven't seen your Oreos. Just take your bath without them. So why was it his lucky day? Well, it turns out I had a little rocket fuel in the apartment. What were you doing with rocket fuel in your apartment? Mm, Joyce Kim was kind of curious about what I did for a living, and I was going to kind of show it to her. <laughs> it's not important. The point is, the guys and I went back to the apartment. Are we ever going to get to the elevator? Yeah, we're really close. Uh, we're at the apartment. The trick is to mix it into Tovex in order to create a combustible gel that will generate over 8,000 kilonewtons of thrust. <laughs> cool. Won't work. Excuse me, but I've been working on this a long time. Trust me, it'll work. You don't see your mistake, do you? There's no mistake. This is for a full-scale rocket, not a model. Well, I've adjusted the formula. Not correctly. <laughs> okay, I've had it with you. You might be an expert on theoretical physics and science fiction programs and where to sit on a freaking couch, but this is applied physics. And when it comes to applied physics... Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> Happening. A bad thing, a very bad thing. Get the door, get the door, get the door, get the door, get the door! <laughs> You're waiting for the elevator? Oh, right. Wait, it's you! Ah. Give me that. What'd you do that for? I had plenty of time. You're welcome. Not only did Sheldon save my life, he didn't rat me out to the landlord, or the police, or Homeland Security. Okay, so basically you're the reason I have to walk up and down three flights of stairs every day? So I did something stupid. I'm sure you did stupid things when you were younger. What were you doing seven years ago? Excuse me, I was in high school. I was studying, keeping my nose clean, doing volunteer work for the community. <laughs> Not pregnant! Yes! <laughs> 